Hey, what's going on guys? Mr. The Reverts here and today I'm gonna give you guys my theory on who the Shadow Man is for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies. Now, the Shadow Man is a new character that was introduced for the new map Shadows of Evil and that's really all we know. We haven't really seen what the guy looks like, but we have heard a few quotes from him from the Black Ops 3 Zombies revealed trailer and I'm gonna play a few of those quotes for you guys right now. Your sins serve only as an invitation. An invitation to an evil. Beyond your imagination, you are. I have seen each and every one of your misdeeds. So after listening to those two quotes, I came to the conclusion that the Shadow Man is actually the Grim Reaper. I know it might seem a little far-fetched, but after hearing those two quotes, this theory of mine might actually have some truth to it. Because the Shadow Man does say, your sins serve as an invitation to an evil beyond your imagination. And according to mythology, the Reaper is the person that takes you to hell depending on whether or not you were good on Earth. And I do think the Shadow Man could have taken the four characters to hell because of their sins. And the quote you you just heard does sound like he was responsible for the four characters having to fight the undead or the zombies. Now, he also goes on to say, I know who you are. I have seen each and every one of your misdeeds. And again, to me, that quote does support my theory of the Shadow Man actually being the Grim Reaper. Now, I'm going to take you back to Call of Duty Black Ops 1 and 2 Zombies. On every single map, there was this bloodstained image of the one and only Grim Reaper. And I have a couple of images shown for you guys on screen right now. But like I said, every single Zombies map has at least one bloodstained image of the Grim Reaper. And for a long time, no one really knew what significance the Grim Reaper has to do with Call of Duty Zombies, and everyone pretty much filed this away as another one of Treyarch's Easter eggs like Infinity Ward's teddy bears, but there actually might be some connection this Grim Reaper image has, and my guess is all along it was hinting at the Grim Reaper playing a role in the Call of Duty Zombies storyline. Now I also want to bring something else to your attention, and that's the Unmarked Man. Now, if you take a look at the Unmarked Man, profile picture on Twitter it looks almost exactly the same as the shadow man's profile picture because we see they're both in a silhouette and I'm thinking the unmarked man and the shadow man or the grim reaper are actually the same person and I was going back through a couple of tweets of the unmarked man and I found this one tweet in particular that caught my attention it's up on screen for you guys right now and it says my best work is done in the shadows so when I saw that I thought maybe this tweet is referencing to the map shadows of evil but other than that, like that's really the only tweet that has my reason to believe the Shadow Man is actually the Unmarked Man. And so far, the Unmarked Man is only involved with the campaign for Black Ops 3. So again, my theory is the Shadow Man is actually the Grim Reaper and the Unmarked Man. I also want you guys to let me know what you think of my theory down in the comments. Also, if you have your own theory as to who the Shadow Man is, or if you have your own theory for Black Ops 3 Zombies, let me know that as well down in the comments. Also, don't forget to drop a like if you guys didn't enjoy and are excited for Black Ops 3 Zombies. And don't forget to click that subscribe button for the latest Call of Duty Black Ops 3 news, rumor information. Thank you all for watching. Mine is averts. Have a great rest of the day. Till next time, I'll catch y'all later.